everybody and welcome to Music with Meg. I'm Meg and today we're learning more about rhythm. Everybody follow me, it's Music with Meg. Now we've already learned about crotchets and quavers. Can you remember what they look like? A crotchet is worth one beat and a quaver is worth half a beat. But are there notes that are longer than one beat or shorter than half a beat? Of course there are. And today we're going to learn all of those other notes. This is where music becomes a little bit like maths. But don't worry, you don't have to be good at maths to be great at music. Now let's meet some other notes. First up, we have this note here. Now this is a minim. A minim is worth two beats. So one minim is the same as two crotchets. Now let's use our metronome and clap four crotchets. And now, let's clap two minims. Very good, everybody. Now, there is a note that's even longer than a minim, and that is called a semi-breathe. Now, a semi-breathe is worth four beats. So for every semi-breathe, there would be two minims and four crotchets. Let's clap those crotchets, minims and semi-breathes again. Crotchets. Minims. Semi-breathe. Well done everybody. Now let's go the opposite way. There is a note that is shorter than a quaver and this is called a semi-quaver. A semi-quaver is worth half of a quaver. So for every one quaver there are two semi-quavers and if there are two quavers in a beat that means there are four semi-quavers in a beat. So if these are your quavers Your semi-quavers sound like this. Now let's put our note values into a pyramid so you can see how they all fit together. Let's imagine that we're in 4-4 four, four time, which means that there are four beats in a bar. Now the smallest note value is a semi-quaver, so that's going to go right at the bottom. Now if there are four semi-quavers per beat, then there are 16 semi-quavers in a bar. Now just up from the semi-quavers we have the quavers. Now there are two quavers in every beat, so let's pop them in. Now next up we have our crotchets. Now crotchets are worth one beat. So in a 4-4 four, four bar, there are four crotchets. Next up we have our minims. Now a minim is worth two beats. So in a bar of four there are two minims. And finally right at the top here we've got our semi-breathe. A semi-breathe is worth four beats. So in a four-four bar there's only one semi-breathe. Now, say you want to write a note that's worth three beats. How would you do that? Well, you could take a minim and a crotchet and you can join them together using a tie. Now, a tie joins together the value of the two notes so you don't play them as two separate notes. Now, you can also add a dot to your note to increase the value of the note by half. So a dotted minim would be a minim plus a crotchet. 
So that's two beats plus one beat, which makes three beats. And a dotted crotchet would be a crotchet plus a quaver. So that's one beat plus half a beat, which makes one and a half beats. Let's recap what we learnt today. We learnt all of the different note values. Starting from the shortest note, we have semi-quavers, quavers, crotchets, minims and semi-breathes. We learnt that you can tie two notes together to combine their value. And we learnt that you can add a dot to a note to increase its value by half. Well done today everybody. That was quite a lot of information and you did a great job. Thank you so much for watching everybody. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel so you'll know when my video comes next week. But for now, have a lovely week and I'll see you next time. Bye.